Hello, I'm Dr. Tsui, the acupuncturist, the herbalist, and the artist. So today, <clears throat> I'm going to talk about uh, three things. Uh, number one, I'm going to answer my fans and friends and have some uh, questions about the, their yin and yang balance physically. And uh, number two is I'm going to talk about this art. And uh, number three, I'm going to talk about how, be, how to be a uh, good collector to collect the arts, make you healthy rather than make you sick. So first thing is I'm going to uh, answer my friend's question and uh, he said that he still have uh, the, uh, the twitching on the face and uh, he already probably see the medical doctor and the western doctors and uh, they cannot give them answer why and uh, that's just, uh, understandable and uh, usually you know they cannot uh, treat those kind of condition and uh, you should go to uh, of course uh, use uh, Chinese herbs or acupuncture find the uh, acupuncturist and the herbalist and uh, in your area to help you and uh, if you uh, cannot find anyone you can send me your tongue uh, pictures just uh, stick your tongue like this and uh, take the pictures and uh, send to me and uh, talk with me and uh, on the phone then I can probably send you to send you the herbs so uh, number three and uh, you can uh, use art to balance your system then you may say the what kind of art of course uh, if you have a twitching on the face so above the face that's just yang and uh, the uh, energy flow the meridians the yang meridians going up as you know, the up is yin, and uh, obviously you uh, how to fix your problem is uh, how to uh, to make more yin and cool you down, and uh, so the yin colors is more with the blue and the green, and uh, you try to get more of this color, and also you try to looking for the yin condition, so like a soft line and generally the energy they usually more on the inside. Obviously, women belong to yin. If you're a man, so you uh, you should have uh, find the women that they are uh, soft and uh, nice, and uh, they may can take care of you, change your physical condition, and uh, maybe can help you mentally too. And uh, of course, if you're women, and uh, you may just uh, have to find the yin condition uh, stuff to balance your system. So more related with the blue color or the cooler color, and also quiet, uh, quiet place. So just like uh, people say that you know what you eat and uh, that's what you are, and uh, here we talk about what you view, and uh, what you hear, and uh, what you experience. So make you are, and uh, so that's uh, no difference. We're uh, human being. We're part of the universe and uh, say they do affect our physically, mentally, and spiritually. So uh, that's, uh, thank you, we're going to talk more, and if you uh, have any question, you can email to me. And uh, number two, I'm going to talk about this art. This art uh, actually I made uh, 95, and you can see here, 95. And uh, this uh, art actually is the Statue of Liberty's face and uh, I don't know you can see the difference or not. So uh, I've been painting the Statue of Liberty's face uh, probably about 10-15 uh, years and uh, since uh, after I come from China and uh, I think uh, the uh, Statue of Liberty face is a very iconic and it's very powerful and uh, of course uh, believe it or not see, because you're immigrants sometimes uh, you use this power force to generate your energy and that's why the art is really shows who you are. So, and that's why you create this art. And uh, the color, so this is, uh, I squeeze from the stoop, uh, tubes. So the color is very thick. I don't know if you can tell the difference or not. So that's making the line. And uh, obviously lines, so you can see they're not a breakdown. They're always continuation. So it's like the chi flow. And uh, of course, they have five elements of color, and uh, you can see all those years. Uh, so we try to achieve. I try to achieve uh, what's uh, supposed to do, and uh, with the uh, energy flow continuation. 
So then, and also the five elements of color, so the blue helps the liver and the gallbladder, and uh, the red help the heart, and uh, the yellow help the digestion system, and then you have the white helps the uh, lungs, and the black helps the uh, kidney. So uh, obviously, this painting is uh, pretty balanced. Of course, it's very strong, and they generate a lot of uh, energy, and uh, it's good for the people who uh, review it, like the color, and uh, so it's very powerful. I saw the, quite a few pieces like this with the Statue of Liberty's face. And uh, of course, this is the house, the trees, and they have the moon, and they have the air go through the system. And uh, you can see. And uh, that's, uh, you know, I always uh, get in touch with the nature and the houses and, uh, to try to balance the system. And um, so this is the painting I talk about. If you have more questions about this painting, you can email to me and uh, you have a comments and I have question. So I'm happy to explain to you and uh, hopefully enjoy the art. Okay, here uh, we're gonna talk about uh, how to be a good collectors uh, to collect the arts. Uh, of course, they have a different levels of collectors and uh, you try to sometimes because uh, different reason. Uh, sometimes you try to because uh, uh, you think you can make money on it. That's why sometimes you just enjoy it and it could be bought. And uh, of course, uh, be a, and uh, you never thought about how to really uh, affect your physical condition. Of course, because nobody is uh, talk about it. This is very new, and it's the new movements, and uh, hopefully people understand more. So not only just uh, collect the art to enjoy it or make money, or uh, so you really should uh, understand and uh, to how to enjoy the arts and. Uh, not to throw your physically out of balance. So uh, basically what you do is, uh, first you have to see what your uh, physical condition is. Uh, a lot of times, of course, you, you may don't know you're out of balance. And the example, if you always have a good hot hands, sweating, red eyes, and, uh, and dry skin, easy to get a skin problem or uh, get headaches or uh, so they, you may t tend to your systems more on the hot side and uh, you generate too much yen. And uh, if that situation, usually you go to the gallery or uh, collect the art from the artist, you may tend to like the uh, paintings more on the soft side and a uh, little cooler side and the more blue color. And uh, obviously you enjoy it and they match with your system and then you bring home and they enjoy you live with art. That's a fine that time because you're really correct your imbalance. But the problem is after you hang in there for a while, then uh, so you absorb the, all this information. And uh, sometimes uh, if for too long, sometimes they could be too cool for you. So they can throw you out of balance too. And the other side is uh, if your systems is always have cold hands, cold feet, and the depressed, the weak, tired, and uh, you're looking for the arts, the more little red, have more line movements, and to try to balance your system. That's okay too. And uh, you can hang at home and balance your system. But the problem is, uh, you, once they're balanced, then later on you need to change your art. And otherwise, they can throw you out the balance too. So just to let you know, so it's so, uh, very important to understand that and uh, to understand the yin and yang and uh, how you're physically and balance how you're uh, mentally and spiritually and how's your uh, life and they have too much money or have little money sometimes the money is not exactly really can change you so much just as your personality your physical condition mentally and spiritually so it's a balance or not so i'm going to talk with you more and uh, if you have any question you can email to me Give me comments and uh, I, you can call my cell phone and uh, that's a 203-249-0115. And uh, if you want to support my art, so please and contact with me. I need the support and uh, we talk more and we can continue to show the gallery or museum. So we talk more. Thank you. I really appreciate you watching.